hello guys hope you are doing well welcome to my kitchen today we are making something very delicious we are making native rice please don't forget to click the like button share and subscribe thank you with no further ado let's cook I will start by cooking the rice here I have chicken seasoning onions fresh bay leaf in a pot I will add some water I will add some onions and then add some chicken seasoning and then I will also add fresh bay leaf and finally I will add some sauce to taste I will cover this to bring to a boil for 2 to 3 minutes then open up and add my washed rice and cover up to cook for 8 to 10 minutes and then I will set aside For the list of ingredients, I will be using dry fish washed already with hot water and salt. I have salt margin to taste, some diced onions, some cooked momo diced already. I have some dry big prawns which I have also washed with hot water and salt. I will also be using some palm oil. I have some bell pepper, red and yellow. I have scotch bonnet pepper. I have some onions. I will also be using some carrot chopped into little parts and then I will be using some blended crayfish. At this point I will go ahead to blend the bell pepper, onions and scotch bonnet pepper into rough paste and thereafter I will set aside. Next, in a pan, I will add the palm oil and allow this to hot for some minutes and then add the diced onions. I will also be adding the chopped carrot and then go ahead to give it a stir and allow this to cook for some minutes before adding the next ingredients. Now that the carrot and the onions have been softened, I will go ahead to add the dry fish. I will add the dry prawns as well and then add the kumo and give everything a stir. Now I will be adding the rough blended bell pepper, onions and scotch bonnet pepper and stir as well. I will allow this to cook for 5 to 7 minutes. I will go ahead to add mangi and thereafter I will be adding salt afterward I will add my blended crayfish and stir everything together at this point I will be adding the cooked rice into the cooked sauce and mix everything together equally Look at that guys, look at how beautiful the rice is. I'll go ahead to add my parsley to garnish and then stir everything together and thereafter I will take the rice off the gas. I hope you try this out and when you do please tag me and don't forget to like the video, subscribe and share with your friends and family members. Thank you. Now 
Now that the rice is ready, I'll go ahead to take it off the gas. You can add fried plantain as a side dish or add egg as well. Better still, you can eat it like this without adding any other thing. For me, I just went ahead to add an egg. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in my next video. Bye.